Hi, this is Dave Matthew with an audio precision quick tip. A quick tip provides a brief overview of an APX feature or function. In this quick tip, we're going to look at the reference sync features in the clocks menu in Signal Path Setup. With an APX analyzer attached, the clocks menu is only available if the instrument is fitted with the advanced master clock hardware, which is standard in an APX 555 and an option for the APX 525 and 585 series instruments. You can always view the clocks menu by launching APX 500 without hardware in demo mode. In the clocks menu, you can configure the signal that appears at the AES 11 DARS reference output and the sync output connectors on the instrument rear panel. DARS stands for Digital Audio Reference Signal, and it's defined in the Audio Engineering Society's AES-11. Essentially, a DARS signal is an AES-3 signal with no audio. Output rate affects both connectors and allows you to choose from Track Output SR, or Sample Rate, which uses the current Digital Output Sample Rate as a reference, or Custom, where you can enter an alternative sample rate as a reference. Sync out level and sync out polarity only affect the pulse stream available at the sync out connector. You can also select the time base reference for the APX system. In reference sync input, time base reference, choose internal or an external AES 11 DARS signal applied to the rear panel XLR input or an external pulse stream signal applied to the rear panel sync in BNC connector. For more information, Look in the documentation provided with APX 500 and look for other quick tips at ap.com. Thanks for watching.